Good morning, Bulldogs, and welcome to the Mac Morning Show. I'm Faith. And I'm Ren. And today's Tuesday. Today's Thursday, the 19th of May. Here's your morning weather report. Today we, have, we will have clouds with breaks of sun. There will be a shower or two in the afternoon. The high will be 63 and the low will be 44. The sun rose this morning at 546 and will set this evening at 831. The lunch menu for today is barbecue chicken sandwich with Carolina slaw, beef with broccoli, Hawaiian pizza, and tacos or burritos. Today's fresh fruit snack is watermelon. The following students are celebrating birthdays today. Happy birthday to Deborah Ambrosio, <laughs> Noe Valle, and Jessica Flores. Now for some announcements from our teachers and office staff. The Bulldog Coin Store will be open at lunch today. The deadline to pre-order a yearbook is next Friday, May 27th. Yearbooks are $25 and you may bring a check or cash to the office. If you are not sure if you have already pre-ordered one, there are lists by the ID number that will be posted outside in the office by the hall by the cafeteria. Attention 7th graders, 7th grade native Spanish speakers. If you consider yourself to be fluent, you should consider taking Heritage Spanish next year. Students receive high school credit for the class and work on completing their foreign language requirement to graduate from high school. If you are interested, stop by Mr. Harrison's room before June 1st for more information and to get on the list. Yep, it's coming to Mac on the evening of Friday, June 3rd. The traditional 8th grade send-off celebration is coming up here at Mac on June 3rd from 7 o'clock to 9. This is a Hawaiian-themed send-off being put on by the parents and Mac staff. DJ, huge inflatables, jousting, obstacle courses, hoop shot, pitcher booth, basketball, volleyball, and yes, plenty of free food will all be there. Tickets available at the door on the day of the event. Only $2 gets you in the door. Everything else is free. Questions? See Mr. Parsegian. Track bills will go out next week. Turn in your track uniform and sweats to Mrs. Ford. They must be in a bag with your name on them. The cost of the uniform and sweats is over $100, so make sure you return your gear so you're not charged for it. The 8th grade awards ceremony is on Tuesday, May 24th. This is an invitation-only event. If you're receiving an award, your parents received an invite in the mail, and you'll receive a pass to attend the mandatory practice. Passes will be handed out Monday, May 23rd during 7th period. If you receive a pass, you are receiving an award and you must attend the practice during 7th period on Tuesday, the 24th. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Kipis in the office. Remember that next week is Spirit Week. Tuesday is Tropical Day, Wednesday is Teen Color Day, 1's are blue, 2's are white, and 3's are black. Thursday is Tie Dye Day, and Friday is Black and Gold Day. Now for our segment on this day in history, brought to you by the History Channel. May 19th. In 1536, Anne Boleyn, the second wife of King Henry VIII and mother of the future Queen Elizabeth I, was executed in the Tower of London after being convicted of adultery. On this day in 1967, the U.S., Great Britain, and the Soviet Union ratified a treaty banning nuclear weapons in space. Today in 1994, former First Lady Jacqueline Kennedy Onassis died in New York City at the age of 62. And on this day in 1935, Lawrence of Arabia died. T.E. Lawrence had been a liaison officer between the British Army and Arab fighters in World War I. His exploits were captured in a documentary and shown worldwide. The Arabian adventurer met his end while swerving to avoid two kids on bicycles. And that's this story in history. your Bulldog Bite of the Day. On our last show we asked, the flower buds of what three plants are most commonly eaten as vegetables? The answer is broccoli, artichoke, and cauliflower. Today's question is, in which country would you find the Bay of Pigs? Huh. We'll have the answer for you on our next show. That's it for today's show. Tune in next time for more random facts and your daily news. Have an awesome day.